Long ago, on an island nestled in the sea, the winds of change swept in, turning the leaves gold and red. To the inhabitants of this special place, it could only mean one thing. It was time to celebrate the season's harvest and kick up their heels at the autumn festival known as Mouse Mask. Frog <laughs> Fang is going to get you. <laughs> you can't catch me. <laughs> You're more like Fog Fall, not Fog Fang. <laughs> Look. Hey, you know who could use this? Sweeney for Mouse Mask. For his bird costume. Race you home. Fog Fang is hungry. <laughs> <sighs> Grandpa, tell us about Fog Fang. Oh, well now, the legend of Fog Fang is one that's been told for many a day. No mouse is sure, but it has long been whispered that when the fog rolls in thicker than pea soup and frost greets the morning, late on Mouse Mask Eve, something so frightening steps out of the mist that it makes even the bravest mouse tremble. Fog Fang? Aye, Fog Fang. Does it have sharp teeth and huge claws? Thomas Fielding, stop it right now. <laughs> Mouse Mask is not about monsters and you know it. Mouse Mask is when we gather the harvest together and share it with every mouse. Right, Mama? It's our chance to give thanks. And dress up in costumes. It's the most important festival of the year. No mouse will go hungry this winter, that's for sure. We've all worked hard to make sure the cellars and the cupboards are full. <laughs> I'm full, too. Just three more spoonfuls, dear. I think this is going to be the best mouse mask ever. But Eckhart and his family weren't the only mice preparing for the big night. Some mice had other plans, much darker plans. <laughs> that really suits you. You always was a card, Ned. <laughs> Get it? <laughs> Numb skulls! But it's for Mouse Mask, boss. Mouse Mask? Oh, grow up. You're too old for that stuff. Oh. And how do you know there's even going to be a Mouse Mask this year? Hmm? Well, there always is, boss. That's when all the mice share the food they grew all summer. Yeah, well, we took it easy. They aren't going to share their food with us. They're not? No, they're not. You see, they won't have any food. And do you know why they won't have any food? Uh, no. no. Because we are going to... <laughs> Take it! <laughs> All of it! <laughs> every berry and every seed! We are? I love it! Those suckers work their scrawny little tails off all summer while we... <laughs> Supervised. No, we didn't, boss. We just sat around and watched them. That is supervising, flea brain. Quiet! The two of you! I'm thinking! Hmm. Just take all the food. Nah, it's much too easy. I need something more... something... creative. Something they'll remember me by. I've got it! It's brilliant! You scared us, boss! Exactly. What are you going to be, Eckhart? I don't know yet. Something good, I guess. Oh, fiddlesticks! There'll be no dancing at Mouse Mask if I don't get some new strings on this fiddle. Time to pay a visit to the barn. Can I come too? I have to give Sweeney this neat feather. He's going to be a bird. Come along. Be careful. That barn can be very... We'll be careful. Why is Mouse Mask so important, Grandpa? Mouse Mask helps us survive the long, cold winter ahead. By every mouse sharing in the harvest? Partly. And by having some fun before the snow flies. Very important fun is. <laughs> I wouldn't miss that last dance around the bonfire for the world. Hi, sweetie. Hi, Bridget. 
So good. Keep your wits about you here in the barn. Things aren't always what they appear to be. Yes, Grandpa. Now give me a hand before you visit your friends. Hard to believe, I know, but it seems I'm not as strong as I look. <laughs> Winnie here has graciously offered to donate some of her fine horsehair for my fiddle. Just in time for Mouse Mask. Oh, hers. It's coming, Grandma. <laughs> Whiskers, lad. Thanks for the hand. I mean, hoof, Winnie. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be too long, and whatever you do, be careful. Yes, Grandpa. Can't thank you enough, my dear. <laughs> thank you, Sir Echoes, brave and generous mouse. Yeah. Well, I think you should be Sir Snap the Trap, not Sir Eckard. You're lucky your grandpa was there. Oh, yeah, well, that was pretty dumb. Uh-oh. Fog's coming in. I bet if that mean old fog fang tried to catch you, Echo, you would fight back with all your power <laughs> and win. <laughs> Sweeney. Actually, I don't believe in monsters. How about ghosts? Ogres? Mm -mm. Trolls? Mm -mm. They're just in stories, Sweeney. Oh, and I suppose you don't believe in witches either. No, I don't. Well, what if I told you there's a witch right here in the barn? Up near the bats. You're just making that up. I am not. There is a witch, and she knows and sees everything. Even the cat is afraid of her. Show me. Okay, I will. <laughs> yes, yes, that's it. Bring it to life! <laughs> Phew! It's just bats and shadows up here, Bridget. Shh! What's that? Things aren't always as they seem, you know. Just wait. You'll see. No, Bridget, this is silly. There's no such thing as... <gasps> Probably the witch. Eckhart, dear, there aren't really witches. It's just... But I saw one! Eckhart, think back to the barn today. You learned something important about appearances. I sure did. Well, it's true again. Fog and shadows and wind can make things seem very different. And sometimes very frightening. Come with me, both of you. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
just an old bush. Things really aren't always what they seem to be. And that includes monsters and witches. Katiekins isn't scared anymore. Good. But I really did see something in the barn. The morning of Mouse Mask dawned. All the mice busied themselves, stockpiling their hard-earned harvest and preparing for the big night of celebration. Hmm. Hey, Eckerd, what's your costume going to be? Um. Well, it's going to be a surprise. Even to me. I think this is going to be the... Why, hello, Ned. Shorty. <coughs> Good, Good day, day Mrs. Mrs. Fielding. Fielding. Are you all set for Mouse Mask? Mouse Mask is history. He means Mouse Mask is our tradition. Why, yes, and our very best one. Could we, um... Please borrow your glue? Yeah, for Ned's costume. Huh? Um, uh, it's my last year. <laughs> well, of course you may. Here you go. Thank, Thank you, you, Mrs. Mrs. Fielding. Humph! <laughs> Some wise old mouse once said, things are not always as they appear. Remember? Underneath, they're very sweet. Sweet my feet! I saw something up there, and it wasn't fog. Phew! <laughs> Are you sure you know the plan? Do I have to go over it again? Uh, no. No, no, no sorry. Definitely no, not. not. A... No, no. Uh, yes. Maybe just one time. Uh, all right. Now listen up. When the mice start dancing and the wagon is piled high and ready, <laughs> and that'll scare the very wits right out of them. And then I'll save the day and keep the food. <laughs> Get ready for the final mouse mask ever! No! Oh. Ow. Hey, what the? Hey, you! Uh -oh. Get that little pipsqueak and shut him up, or everything will be ruined! Yes, yes boss! <laughs> oh. I hate that family. Get him! Oh, 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 don't let me fall, Shorty, please! Is you scared? Ooh. Ned, only of heights! Ah. Oh, oh, oh! oh. your tongue, lad? <laughs> Why were those scallywags chasing you? Um... Speak up! I haven't got all day. Yuck! That's Madame Thel's mouse mask special. I call it catnap tea. Catnap tea? It's worked every mouse mask so far. We wouldn't want some nasty cats boiling all the fun, would we? But that's what Boss Mouse is going to do. He's going to wreck it. <gasps> he said this is the last mouse mask ever. 
no more mouse mask. Ich kann bibble. Was mouse my tail? That tawdry excuse for a rodent is really mealy mouth Chauncey Barnes. Chauncey Barnes? He always was a bully, forever trying to spoil the fun. So, what's he got up his sleeve this time? Eckhart couldn't believe his ears. Nothing was as it seemed. Not the soup or boss mouse, and certainly not Madame Fell. We'll put a stop to those shenanigans. But we are going to need a plan. We will? Need teamwork. You in? I'm in. At last, the eve of Mouse Mask arrived. A night of gratitude for nature's bounty and for friendship and fun under the stars. mask ever. Little did Mavis know that this mouse mask would be remembered forever in the tales of mouse lore. Stand up, I said. It's got to be taller. Taller. Are you sure fog fangs aren't fat? I could just stand beside Shorty. And fog fangs are tall. Every mouse knows that flavor in. Now get up there. Just nothing, boss. A masterpiece! I am a genius! Yes, boss? Keep quiet in there before I... shock you one! <laughs> now, let the fun begin! Great costume. Beware of Fog Fang. Yeah, right. Uh oh. It's almost time. I know that's you, Eckerd Fielding. dreaded fog fang. For now, and before it returns, I shall take the harvest and put it in a safe place. Under my watchful eye, there is no need to worry about its safety. Ah, oh, there's no need to thank me. It is the least I can do for the community. Ned, Shorty, I'm starved. No, you idiot! Pull that wagon! Ow! Hmm. Hey, boss! Were we good? <laughs> you deserve a medal. <laughs> Fog Fang! No! No, please don't. Please, I'm, I'm sorry, I was only kidding. <laughs> fog Fang on the berry, I'll share, promise. N nice Fog Fang, nice Fog Fang. Hungry, we'll take it all. I don't need it. I know, you can eat Ned. Uh, or Shorty, he's younger. No, Ned is. Just don't hurt me. <laughs> he's just a big scared cat. 
<laughs> Get on with it. Go hide your tails in a dark corner where you belong. Oh. He saved Mouse Mask! We just had to stop them. We? Let me present my new friend, Madame Fell. Well, what are you all standing around for? There's dancing to be done. Merry Mouse Mask! <laughs> Funny, isn't it? Sometimes you just have to wait or look closer or listen better to know what's really true. You're on to something there. You can look at something one way and the next time you see it, it's changed. Like a witch might be a friend or a big bully might really just be a coward underneath. And that ferocious fog thing might just be part of the family. <laughs> <laughs>